All right, well, today is a special day. What are we going to be celebrating tomorrow? Christmas. And Christmas is day. Uh, no, not mine. <laughs> it's Jesus' birthday tomorrow. I want you to imagine, before I read my story today, we have a special story. I want you to imagine what it feels like when you're very tired and you snuggle into what your bed looks like and your favorite pillow and you might have a special blanket or maybe special noise going. Can you feel that? Can you feel what it feels like? Does it feel good? Warm and snuggly, it feels really good. So I want you to think about that as I'm telling the story. Today the story is called Room for a Little One, okay? And if you can't see the pictures too good, feel free to come a little closer. It was a cold winter's night. Kind ox lay in the stable close to the side of the inn. Old dog came by. He stopped and looked into the stable. I need somewhere to rest, said old dog. Come inside, kind ox said. There's always room for a little one here. So old dog came in and lay down in the straw. He nestled close to kind ox sharing the warmth of the stable. Stray Cat peered in. She saw old dog and she stopped. Stray Cat arched her back and her fur bristled. I'll not chase you, said old dog. Come inside, said kind ox. There's always room for a little one here. So can you see the cat? So Stray Cat came into the stable. She curled up in the straw, close to the friend she had found, purring and twitching her tail. Small Mouse stopped at the door of the stable. Uh oh, she saw a stray cat and she quivered with fear. You're safe here. I won't harm you, said stray cat. Come inside, kind Doc said. There's always room for a little one here. Small Mouse scurried in. She nestled down warm in the straw in the peace of the stable. <coughs> then Tired Donkey came. Joseph led him along. Mary rode on Tired Donkey's back. Joseph was cold and Mary was weary, but there was no room in the inn. Where will my baby be born, Mary asked. Come inside, kind ox said to tired donkey. There's always room for a little one here. So tired donkey brought Mary into the stable. Joseph made her a warm bed in the straw to save her from the cold of the night. And so Jesus was born with the animals around him. Kind ox, old dog, stray cat, small mouse, and tired donkey all welcomed him into the warmth of the stable. That cold winter's night beneath the star's light, a little one came for the world. And just like there's always was room in that stable for everyone, God always has room for us. Here at Pilgrim, we welcome everyone in, and God welcomes you no matter how tall you are, how short you are, what color your hair is, you wear glasses, you don't wear glasses. God welcomes us all. And today I'd like to, while we're singing away in the major, I'd like it if we would line up and I'd like to do a little blessing, if you're okay if I touch your shoulder or your hand. And I'd like to do a little blessing for each of you to show how we here at Pilgrim and God's love, we want to carry that out through the year. 